Hey, what's up everybody, Electrokuski here. So I am bringing you, finally I was able to get it, um, I told you guys about this last, um, in the part 10 of, of my Searching for Ultra Ball series. Um, I finally got this in, um, I actually got it in a while ago, just haven't really been able, and I didn't want to try and schedule it in between recordings um, of doing things like, uh, just all the all the stuff I had recorded and going up um, before, so I'm finally getting to opening this. So we are popping this open. This is going to kind of be a. I'm not going to be make it part of the hunt um, or the searching for the hyper rare Charizard, just because um, I want that to kind of be its own series once I start really working on that. So, um, but here we are going to be doing, uh, I don't even know why I'm doing that. It's just going to get taken out anyway. So, let's get, we're going to be doing this into three parts. Um, so, they're going up just all in a row. Um, so yeah, we're going to get 12 packs out because it is going to be 12 packs apart. Um, and just see what we can get. Let's hope to get something awesome. Um, if you guys haven't seen opening up some burning shadows from um, from Barnes and Noble definitely go check that video out I will uh, put an iCard in the um, in the video about here and also put a link down in the description about that you guys will not want to miss that so we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve this is just gonna go off to the side for the moment so we've got Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right. And again, I kind of talked to you guys. I told you guys um, what the new idea was going to be for codes. It is these cards here. These cards are basically going to be the ones to tell us which packs um, codes are pulled from. So basically, um, again, I'm going to shuffle them up like I'm doing here. Like you guys can see. And basically, I have no idea. Um, there's one for everything, one for every type. So um, I'll show you guys before I shuffle them up again. One for every type. And essentially, if the rare card, whether it's um, regular, rare, hollow rare, if it's a GX, hyper rare, GX, whatever, if the rare Pokemon matches the type um, that this is, that this card gets pulled then that means the code is going to get shown and given away um, just in the video um, whereas if it doesn't match or it also will get given away if it's a trainer card just so you guys are aware um, but yeah and then basically if it's not if it doesn't match I keep the code for myself to use in the TCGO um, or to possibly just hold on to for a future giveaway um, but we'll see so let's get this and see what we can get so the the main one that we're looking for is darkness so that's gonna be the necrozma um necrozma gx i think there's another one okay so there are i um there are quite a few different rares that are in the set i want to make sure um that there wasn't just the necrozma of the dark rye um so that is going to be a pretty fair chance of getting something so I'm just going to move this, uh, let's put it up here. Um, also what I'm kind of doing with this is a profit or loss video. Um, not saying that I'm selling any of these cards, but just as a, um, a fun, a fun kind of thing to do with it. So you're going to see a total in the, um, bottom right of the screen. And basically that's going to be, that is the, um, amount right now. Uh, the 9309 is what essentially I paid for this box that I got it from coolstuffinc.com um, and that's after taking off the um, the discount that I got because when you buy a lot of stuff from uh, cool stuff you actually go up in levels and then take, take takes money off its whole process so I'm gonna do a profit or loss it's basically just gonna show up on the screen I don't have the info with me right away um, but we'll see so, we're going to get started with this first Ho-Oh pack, um, and yeah, see what, we can, what kind of pulls we can get. Pull my garbage can closer. Uh, I think I'll have to blur that out or something. So, actually, yeah. Blur, there's the code for that. 
and darkness is the co is the uh, energy. I don't, we're not really playing against the energy. So we have a Rubombi, Guzma, that's gonna be worth something at least. Whirlipede, Mudbray, and a Lolan Rattata, Panpour, Caterpie, Porygon, a Reverse Hollow Morlul, and an Araquanid. So that is no go on that. Um, so that code, again, I'm going to have to blur out if it showed. Actually, I'm just going to keep it down here. Mm, okay, so there's that code. I'm not going to bother with showing the, uh, the energy because it doesn't matter at this point. Okay. Alright, so we're starting off with a Stuffle. A Pansage, Krogunk, Pikachu, Metapod, Wishful Baton, and Acerola, Panpour, Tangela, Reverse Hollow, and a Crabominable Regular Rare. So that's another one because it is a fighting energy and not a dark type. Alright, I'm gonna have to. Okay, sitting just on my lap right now with the numbers up. So we have a Pikachu, Panpour, Cutie Fly, a Panseer, Magikarp, Lunatone, Meowth. I'm trying Meowth. Oh wait, Did I, I messed something up. Meowth Reverse Hollow, Olivia, Curlia. Ledian and okay, what did I? How did I mess that up? Where's the painful cutie Oh, Ledian was so I must. I must. Not, I don't know what I did. Okay, well, so focused on trying to do this this code um, that I'm worried about. Okay, all right. Try and go through these a little bit faster. Um. Alright. Alright, one, two, three, one, two, three. Oh, you know what? That's right. I did I did it right. Um I just I'm doing it different. I'm doing the three three to three. So we have Wimpod. A Togemaru, Krogunk, Panseer, Magikarp, Electric, Rhydon, Bodybuilding Dumbbells, a Reverse Hollow Scolopy, that is a rare, so that's awesome, and a Lucario Hollow, very nice, and we have an Electric Energy, so, of course, the uh, rare did not match, but that is still okay, still an awesome card to pull. I'm hoping that I do at least get it, because I think I still need Darkrai um, Hollow, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. Alright, so we have Ralts, Alolan Grimer, Sneasel, Crabrawler, Meowth, Rotom Dex, Pokefinder Mode, Seedra, Plumeria, a Reverse Hollow Charmander, our rare is a Malamar, so that's awesome. It's not a Hollow, but that's awesome. And we have the Grass Energy, so here is that code for you guys. So go ahead and snag that code, let me know what you get. If you um, get anything awesome, I would love to hear. Uh, maybe you guys got that Hyper Rare Charizard, you never know. So, let's see... Alright, and we are starting out with a Crabrawler, Me oh, not right there, Meowth, Stuffle, Pansage, Krogunk, Noctowl, Simipore, Bufalant, Kiawe Reverse Hollow, and a Weavile Hollow, our regular rare. That's awesome, so that actually means another code for you guys, 
definitely leave a comment. Let me, let me know what you get in that in the movie zone, because that's where the camera's gonna go. Move this guy over. All right. I just realized I wanna have enough room left on the screen for the camera. All right, I'm really hoping, um, so that basically means so far we haven't gotten a um, GX or anything. I'm hoping we get something soon. I would love that. Um, we're going to start with a Lediba, a Lolan Grimer, Riolu, Meowth, a Lolan Vulpix, a Sophocles, Electabuzz, Super Scoop Up, our reverse is a Crabrawler, and our rare is... Oh my god, guys, we got the Guard of War GX. That is beautiful. That is amazing. Just love that card. Oh my god, I'm gonna say I'm gonna tell you guys, if you guys haven't seen my opening, um, it would have it would have gone up Saturday. Um, I believe. Make sure. Yes, it went up Saturday. That you guys have to go watch that. That was amazing what I got in it. Okay, it is in the sleeve. There we go. Just absolutely gorgeous, guys. I don't know why it's not going to focus. That is awesome. So that's going to go right there covering up Lucario. But because it was in the dark, it means it's not going you're not going to be getting the code for that unfortunately. So Mind you guys, I'm not, I don't, I have no idea, I'm not looking at the backs of the codes, um, I'm just looking at the numbers for it. So that's actually the first real hit of this box. We have a Horsey, a Mudbray, Lediba, Hoot Hoot, Alolan Vulpix, Kiawe, Mount Lanakila, Electabuzz, a reverse hollow potown, which I actually need, and a regular rare scolipede. So not a dark type. So no code for that. And get that over here. All right, sorry guys. Um, had to stop the video and restart it just because of the fact that um, again I am recording it at a higher uh, quality than it was before. So I have to actually make sure, um, and I have to cut or because it's recording at a higher quality. I do have to make sure that I am um, stopping it because it only records about 14 minutes. So we are going to start out with a Hoot Hoot, a Lolan Vulpix, oh, come on, Ralts, a Lolan Grimer, Sneasel, Soul Rock, Semipore, Bodybuilding Dumbbells, a Lucario Reverse Hollows. So that's actually. That is awesome to get that, as well as the hollow, and a hollow Hallow Sand. That is amazing. It's not a psychic energy, or it's, not, it's a psychic type. Sorry guys, my dogs, of course, have to go nuts whenever someone comes home. But that's awesome, so we have a Hallow Sand as well. Just gonna have to go there. All right, moving on to the Almost. This is the third to last pack. So, and that. Mm, yes, that there, that there. All right. So we have a Sneasel, a Venipede, Horsey, Sandy Yast. We just pulled your look at that big brother cutie fly oh. Lana Heatmore a Simiseer a reverse hollow is on the Lolan Grimer and oh my god guys a Marshadow GX that is a fighting type so no code on that but that is amazing still nonetheless I'm sorry guys my dogs are absolutely they're extremely loud. Um, again, they just, they love to bark at anyone whenever someone comes in the house. Um, I think my sister is actually having a bonfire, so people are coming over. Let's get this in. But that is amazing. So that is the second 
that's actually going to be a good amount for this part of the box. All right. And we're going to start out with, let's see, let's see. See if we can get any more dark. I think, again, I think I need a dark rye. Definitely, um, so that would help you guys at all. So we have a Stuffle for Brawler, a Morlil, Sandygast, Venipede, Wick, Mountain Lakila, a Wishful Baton, Reverse Hollow is a Horsey, and our rare is a Heracross. Regular rare, unfortunately. On the last pack, we got Marshadow uh, after we got the Marshadow GX card. So let us see if maybe we can't use Marshadow's luck to pull another GX. That would be absolutely amazing. I would love that so much. All right. I keep forgetting that I need to turn it around if I'm going to do that. Energy. All right, guys. Here's the last pack of this part of the video of the box, I should say. We are going to start out with a Sandigast, a Venipede, Horsey, Mudbray, Lediba, Dusclops, Charmeleon, a Tormenting Spray, our Reverse Hollow is a Lone Eradicate, and what is our last rare of this box going to be, or of this part? A Holographic Zygarde, that is awesome. I think I might already have this, but that doesn't mean it can't go into the trade binder. That is amazing. So that's a pretty decent way to stop this part of the box. So let's get all of these pulls together. So as a recap, open up, opening up 12, 12 booster packs from this box. We have a Zygarde Hollow, a Palosand Hollow, a Lucario Hollow, the amazing, amazing one of the mascots of the with the pack art, Marshadow GX, and the beautiful, beautiful Gardevoir GX. Love this card. This is definitely going to help in the profit. Um, whether I make a profit make a profit. Again, I'm not actually going to be selling these because a lot, I need still quite a few GX's for my collection. So, we're going to do a quick cut and I will come back with a current total of what we are at. Again, our goal is like 93.09. Um, so, I'll see you guys in just a moment. Alright everyone, so after that moment, um, I did all the calculations. Um, for the stuff that's individually priced, I basically just did the, uh, I took TCG players market value, um, and just used that. It's a general, it's a pretty decent average, um, it's not always correct, but for this moment we'll use it. So we have Gardevoir GX here at 1437, Marshadow GX at 332, Guzma on its own, just this one Guzma card. $1.30. The rares all together came to 92 cents. They aren't really, the rares aren't worth all that much anyway. Um, then for the bulk ones, I just used amounts that I would get trading them in to um, Troll and Toad because they're one of the only places that actually is doing like bulk at the moment that I, I found. Rares, 84 cents. Reverse rares are um, 36 cents. Reverse commons and uncommons, 90 cents. And bulk common and uncommons are 285 total. So that gives us a total of 2486. So that's 2486 for a third of the box. It's gonna be hard to get to that 90 um what was it? 9309. It's gonna be hard to get to that. Well we're gonna try. Um depending on what our wild card is, if we get all at least the six for the average, we'll see. Check or come back tomorrow, guys. I will see you all later. Um, let me know if you enjoyed the video. Leave a like down below. If you aren't subscribed already, hit the subscribe button. Hit that bell icon. Um, that way you get notified notified whenever um, I post any new videos. And comment down below what you guys thought. What you guys think of this this new setup? I know it's a little weird, a little different to get used to. Um, just trying to do something a little bit um, unique, I guess, for someone whose channel is like this size. 
So I will see you all tomorrow. Um, hope you guys have a great day and I'll talk to you later. Bye guys.